Um, Andrea. That's your boyfriend. Andrea Denver. Andres. No, so many and uh, and Andrews. Oh wait. Oh yeah, my name may my yeah. name is Andres. Yeah, you'd be Andres. Andres is just Spanish Andy. What's going on, everybody? Hi, everybody. Today we're joined with the famous and infamous Sergeant Pupper. Sergeant Pupper. Ooh, so good to be here. Max, what is your full first name? Maximilian. Maximus. Any other guesses? Or is it Maxi Pad? Maxi Pad? Uh, no, it's actually just Max. My mom did not want to name me anything I couldn't spell. Hmm. So today we're in Max's apartment, and we're gonna do. We're doing Instagram crushes. Hi, and welcome to Andrew Goes Places channel. I'm Max. This is Andrew. Y'all know Sarge, and we're gonna list our favorite sexiest Instagrammers of all time, or at least for today. Yeah. So um. I've done this video before where I uh, pull up some guys that I'm kind of like stalking on Instagram recently. Weird point is that Max was actually one of those guys one time. So what I'm going to do then is I'm going to start bringing guys from my hottest Instagram list into the video so that then they can talk about them. And then look, I get to hang out with my hot Instagram. This is like the YouTube equivalent of a circle jerk. I'm so good for it. It is. So, I last mentioned Pietro Baselli in my video, so hey Pietro, come do a video with me about Instagram crushes. I'll run sound. Yeah, you run sound. We're just gonna kind of like scroll through our Instagrams and people that we follow or people that we know, we're gonna like show each other and then we're gonna do thumbs up, thumbs down, like whether or not you agree that they are list worthy for Instagram crushes. Let's see, let's go to my first guy. Thumbs then, up! Oh, um, you're not even in the app yet. I'm um, going, I'm going, all right, so let's <laughs> see. Um, oh my gosh, Ooh. so sick. His name is Brian Diaz. His Instagram is Nopolitas. I think he is beautiful. Is that Greek? He is. Ooh. Isn't he pretty? Look at that chest. I like that he's got like an athletic shirt but tucked like, into but jeans. But he's not. Um, you think he's verse? I think he's verse. Okay. Is that what the question is? Is that what the thumbs up and down is? Is like the, this one the verse? Oh, we encourage all. Oh, all, we're approving. Oh, we're, okay. We encourage all sexual positions here. Hell yeah. Um, look at how pretty, look at those lips. Wow. I wish I had those lips. A lot of people tell me that they think that I've had lip injections. Have you? I have not. Do you go like this a lot? You're ah, I can get so, swell up. I played trumpet. I played trumpet for several years and I played through college. And I, the position that I played in, I actually played with the trumpet tilted down a little bit, and it caused my lip to continuously be pushed out like that. And I think that's why we're. That's actually stuff. really a good idea because trumpet think, playing. Yeah, like, well, especially for like white boys, we got that like hairy, that thin upper lip. Yeah, well, it like, didn't really help my upper like, lip very much. It's like that British. So the trumpet thing. just helped your lower lip a lot, and then it kind of fucked up my upper lip. So really, yeah. Oh, I played trumpet too, actually. Did you really? Mm -hmm. You would be a trumpet player. Well, I see that. Yeah. All right, have you met Leif Ashley? I don't think so. Leif, oh, that's with Leif and Gus. Ooh, I want to be the hot dog I in that one. I want to be the meat in that sandwich. Oh, I would love to wow. see them make out. Um, Are they dating? I don't think so. Oh. I think they were just doing a cover for, oh, okay. yeah. what is that, Out, yeah. Advocate, Attitude. Leif, what does Leif do? He's just... Everything. Really arts and entertainment. Lots of arts, lots of yeah, entertainment. Was... Yeah. Oh I'm... my gosh. Yeah. Very beautiful. Those yeah, lips. Yeah, I met him on set once for just a random shoot with Matt Manette. Ah, so pretty. And I almost broke up with Andreas. Sorry, Andreas. He was okay with it, he understood. He's beautiful. But look at that. He's trans, he's all of the things. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh my god, he's he beautiful. He does it. So I actually know this guy. His, uh, his Instagram is Space Cowboy Mez. His, his name is Jamez. He's a DJ here in Los Angeles. And I think he is so beautiful. I actually know him. I like his style. Relatively like well. Slightly weird. But like, he's like beautiful. He's Ooh. got the prettiest cheekbones and structure. Eyes. Right? Isn't he beautiful? Like, um, if you saw those eyes in also... like the pound, you would have to adopt. Like that's just the puppy doggiest eyes. Like you would like if you were eating a sandwich and he looked at you, I would just give him the whole sandwich. Give him that sandwich. Give him that sandwich. He's also like a super sweet, down to earth, and he's so young. Like for being young and like smart and educated, he like he like knows what's up. He's such a nice guy. And he's a DJ. And he's a DJ, yeah. And he's Do got. Do you think he play my birthday? Uh, I don't know. Let's ask him, Jamez. You wanna play his birthday? Look at his body too. Woo! 
this next guy is someone that Andres and I were at Fire Island uh -oh. with a buddy of ours. I know how this story starts. So Andres and him were in Fire Island with a buddy of theirs. And all right, so this guy's name is Tom Zalek. Oh, wow. Yeah, a buddy of ours kind of like scouted him on the beach. He's from Croatia. So he's going to be dog sitting for us um, over Christmas. Okay, well, I'll come over. Mm -hmm. He's very handsome. He's Sorry like, to request it in person. He's like traditionally all American handsome, too. Mm -hmm. You know, like. Well, you like Boyer. So like he's got this he face. Did, no, he like, is. You yeah, think he's going to be like, hey, I'm Tom. He's from Croatia. He's got this adorable accent? Eastern European accent. It's like, hello, I am Tom. Look at him. It's he's so cute. So pretty. Mm -hmm. He's got like dimples. He's got those sandwich eyes. I mean, he's pretty. He's very beautiful. Okay, yeah, he gets a thumbs up. No mm -hmm. one's gonna get a thumbs down in this, I feel like. We're I both, know. We're we, thirsty. Yeah. Whoop! Oh my god. This we is got, my this is my future husband. Oh, okay. is it me? Uh no. Is it Andres? Uh, Can three people get married yet? He... Yes, they can. Um, so his name, and I may have included him on this before, but he's gonna be included again because I'm gonna marry him. And this is he's harassment. He's like on every list? Probably, maybe, I don't know, I don't remember, maybe. Uh, is he a homosexual? No, he's very straight. And he may or may not have filed for some kind of like harassment restraining order Ooh, from me already. Ooh, restraining order. Yeah, and that's fine because Kevin, coming for you. So I'm not entirely convinced here. I'm only seeing the thumbnails. I haven't seen a close up, but it kind of looks like you. I'm not entirely sure that this isn't like your straight alter ego and you've made up this restraining order thing yeah. so that you don't have to be in the same room at the same time. Oh, um, you not look anything alike. A little bit, okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, that's that's that is a different person. Okay, so yeah, this is a different person. I love the M&M shirt because oh that's, my it's God. telling. It tells that he's you straight. It's gonna eat him up. Oh my God. Is I'm that sorry. not insane? I'm sorry, what? Yeah, I, yeah, look at those legs. And he's got, he always has this like super cheesy, like mm -hmm. grin. I think he's adorable. That That particular picture, it's like the, the cat walking away from the explosion. Like he totally just did something in that car behind him. Oh, me. I wish it was me. So this one might surprise you because they're doing drag now. Okay. They used to be a PA on set for my sketches in New York. Um, when we were shooting Drag Babies, he flaked. His name is Jordan Archibald. He flaked because he had a callback for Kinky Boots, the tour. Whoa. And he booked it, so. I love Kinky Boots. Yeah, he ended up doing the national tour of Kinky Boots for like two or three years or something. And now he's back in New York and doing drag, and he's electrolyte. So that's that's him as a boy. Beautiful. Beautiful. Nice I think I, he identifies as he, they. So okay. semi non binary. Okay. Yeah. Um, and this is Electra. Whoa. Wow. Hot. Right? Looking good. I know, I'm about to cross over. I went to a show in New York last week. I had never seen her perform. They were at therapy doing the help show, and this bitch was on the stage, grabs the light rig, does a split on the ceiling, like whap, drops into a split on the floor. It was one of the coolest things I have ever seen in my entire life. I, I was like questioning you do my that. life choices. I, like you could do that. I am not that flexible. Not there at least. Mm -hmm. Electrolyte. Electrolyte. If you're in New York, go check her out. Oh my gosh, she's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Get you a man that can do both. <laughs> okay, Howen. Do you know who Howen Wong is? Bye, Howen. Thickest Asian, Asian DJ. DJ. Yeah, another DJ. Man, I must have a thing for DJs. Those words. Yeah, he is so cute he's to me. around the desert. Oh. Is he cute? I think he's adorable. He's adorable. Like, he's ripped, he's got that bulge. What's yeah, that to love? I think he's really cute. Um, I also love his- Is he a Virgo? Virgo season? A little slow motion water action? I really like the, um, like, he's kind of like bro -y mask, but like also showing like artistic and feminine sides. Yeah, yeah, he's definitely- And the aesthetic of his social media is always really, yeah, like, it's very like, like that's so pretty, like I love that. Um, Sarge is into it. Look. Oh my gosh. Sarge just crossed the frame. Oh my gosh. Sarge is ready. Look. Oh my god. But gosh. he is one of the most beautiful human beings I have ever met. His name is Russell Davies. He's the founder of a nonprofit charity called PTSD Athletes. And they're in Idaho or something. I met him when a buddy of mine was shooting a Shark Tank pitch for a 
protein, a protein powder, like the super high quality thing. They're working together on it. The protein goes to benefit his charity. And they take veterans with PTSD on adventure sports. So they go like mountain biking, kayaking, whatever else things I'll you can do I'll tell you yeah so he's been inviting me to come up and I'm like dying to go but I haven't been able to find is that time. him and I'm also a little bit worried that like you would I don't, him up. I don't think I'd be capable of sharing a tent with this man <gasps> oh my yeah. god okay so I don't love body hair you do I don't now. I don't love it but like it's kind of working for me mm -hmm. I don't like facial hair though I don't love a ton of facial hair like you could big shit can you think you would yeah, for you here let me ask <laughs> Have you heard of this guy? I mean, look at that. Oh, oh, look, God. look at that. You're gonna He's have doing to do a pinch zoom on you're... my personal picture here. Yeah, you're gonna have to do that in the video. Test. I will tell you that uh, I wasn't wearing underwear and I should have been wearing no, underwear. No, you should not have been, but and that's just normal. Like, so did you have to this, this is the original, but it was too much. We had to blur out some of that area because you can literally scratch and snip. <laughs> okay, so you were on my list once. I appreciate that. And now I wasn't in the I top three, this. but you know what? Maybe we can. We don't really do like a rank. There, we're not. We're like very open to all. Once we learn about beauties. those trumpet lips, maybe it'll change. My lip injections that everyone says I get. Everyone thinks I get lip injections. I'm gonna go back to baritone lips. <laughs> the mouthpiece for a baritone is wider. If you're wondering what the hell I'm doing. So I got another Andrew on here. I got another mm -hmm. Andy. It's a Colombian Andy, it's a Spanish Andy. Oh Andrew. my gosh, he's so beautiful. Andres. Thumbs up. I know. Actually, Andres was kind of in my video too, because I was like, Max. Yeah, I got a smooch in him. And I was like, look at, they're so hot. Look Mus at those boogie they're both board so skills. muscular. They look both... at that, look at that like military Captain Hernandez face I'm as he's dragging his dick through a wave. I've never boogie boarded or surfed before, and I think I might go with them. You're gonna learn today. And I'm terrified. I'm just very sensitive to cold. Who are all of these beautiful boys that you guys know? How do you know all of these beautiful people? Well, that's uh, that's who we're going to Europe with in like, Turkey Day if you want to come. Okay, yeah, maybe I will. Andres is only number two on my list. Oh, Andres number two. I can't wait to see number one. This motherfucker. The Whoa. Goodest. He's a total Most top. Beautiful. Total top? No, I think he's, I, I mean, I've seen him at the dog party. It's kind of whatever. Um, I'm not really interested in that though. It's more just like um, I just want to cuddle his message, with that. His Sh message. Show them, show them who it is. Oh, I already showed them. They can see it. it's already on the screen. Oh, uh, and he, he. Crushes uh, don't have to be sexual. He, I feel like he, uh, he has a great message. You gonna use that picture? He. Oh. Um, Sorry, just a rescue. He's from Fur Baby Rescue. If you're looking for one. Oh yeah, rescue from fur baby. You were a rescue. You're so sweet. Who uh, rescued him? <laughs> exactly what you think just happened. Happened. happened yeah, it did. Thanks for having me on your, your, your sexy guy show. Oh, what do, you, what do you got going on? What do you got coming out? Um, I just started doing the Patreon thing, and it's been really helpful in just getting more videos out all the time. So I've been able to hire an editor. Uh, we're going to be shooting a new episode for a series that I'm launching called Revenge Dates, where I get revenge on my boyfriend Andres for the crime of having a nine to five job. Yeah. By going on friend dates with some of the most interesting people I know around Los Angeles. No one's ever called me interesting before. Well, you know, I don't know you that well yet, so we're okay. gonna, yeah. I'm, okay. I'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt. Yeah. Oh, well, yeah, okay. Yeah. So check out the video, obviously, on his channel. Subscribe to Max and check out his Patreon. You can. Yeah. More revenge dates. It's going to launch in like a couple weeks. I'm excited. We're going to have so much fun. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure you subscribe if you don't already. Um, we'll see you guys soon. And remember, never stop learning. Learning. Never stop learning. See you guys I just later. learned how to do that. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs>